Welcome back everyone to the Town 14 in Eden's Edge where today if you guys are going to see the build day for three more days left in CWL. So it's 54 to 34 right now and we are going to be hitting a Town Hall 14 this time. Um, not much really of a hit up because you can see their house is a Town 15 literally. So we just have one 15, 14s and 13. So we'll be hitting um, our counterpart. So basically our same Town Hall in this war so this is the base that we'll be hitting and the arm i'm going to be using is another super bowl smash we've probably been enjoying it i've been having fun with super bowl smash on top 14. let me know if you want to see another smash army like the super bitches maybe um just let me know if you want to see that as well hopefully i can get that done hopefully i can plan one for a, a higher base or even a lower base we'll see for 14 or for 16 or 15 whatever uh floats our boat so what we're going to be doing for this plan is we're going to be running in a our ground wall over here. So I want to basically try and get him like these four buildings technically, like having the bow as well. So I'm calling for defenses as mortar, cannon, I mean mortar, archer tower, air defense, um bow. We'll definitely get these defenses out, but these are like the main targets that I want to really get. And then I'm gonna drop my flame flame over here. And the flame finger takes this out and it's gonna be taking basically taking all of these out first. I will then drop a, a Yeti that I have and to basically tank with this mortar and help take it and help take it out. And then I'm gonna run everything through the middle of here. So the first jump, as I have two, will go here because I don't want to connect them into this compartment yet. I want to basically try to get them over to both scatters, and I do have my RC as well. I can f use the RC over here or up top here, depending on where all of my troops go. If my troops push down through the, the jump, they'll probably go up top. But if they do end up pushing down, I can then use the RC over here for mainly of like a, a assassin to swoop in over here. I don't freeze it necessarily, like I probably will. And we use our spells basically um, to push everything together because you always want to have your troops together. This is one army that especially smash attacks that runs healers they need to be together so that the, the spells that are used are used with high efficiency instead of you raise like two boulders or anything they still will work well because they have the triple bunks but you mainly want to keep everything together because they do more damage together than apart like every like any army in this game do more damage together than their part in a sense so with that said and then the cc that i'm looking at and there's no cc too so i'll save the uh, i have a poison for skeletons, that's like the whole reason. Whole reason for that they have um for skeleton traps that oppose the RC like in this compartment or something. I uh, skeletons that hit my flame flinger, whatever the sort. That's why I have the poison. Um but if that's done, done and you guys see the base city army, what goes on do? Let's crush it. And I have hogs this time in, in the CC, so I have hogs to supplement my RC as well. So when the hogs come over here. I could even use my RC here. So I had, like I said, more plans on one for one troop. So ground one and down. Ground one is gonna be used up take out two cannons, an arch tower, a bow, and all this and all these sorts of a shopping list. <laughs> so I'm gonna drop a bloom over here. And knowing knowing that there's no much not much traps over there, I still tend to use the bloom to look for seeking and it's just just basically or even mainly their main goal is to find um the tezzas that's like their main angle to find tezzas that is their goal for sure so i'm gonna let my ground runner work and he's gonna do his magic and uh, while my flame fling is working i'm gonna hopefully drop my main troops here in a second i'll drop bear dragon to set that funnel right there um i want to draw the yeti now which i will do that now and while the ground runner is taking out the bow which he just did I'm now gonna start my main push. And you can see I tend to drop everything together. Drop everything together, and then you start your main push through with the rage. My if my queen walks is okay, um, my queen tends to love walking over to the other side. But my, my flame fling is still working pretty nicely. I'm gonna pop my king's ability here in a second, because he is working on the defensive troops. Well, I'll start working on the CC. And everything is working through nicely. We do hit the tornado trap, but they're on, on the, the eternal tone. So the the that's not really doing much against them. 
I'm going to freeze that over there because the bull was hitting the, sorry, the, oh my god, what's the name of it? The mortar. Oh god, why was I so tongue twisted there just now? The mortar was actually hitting my flare flare, but that's basically okay. I'm going to release my hogs or the CC right now. And you can see the skeletons that were literally what I was talking about that I had my poison for just popped out um, for my, my troops. So I will freeze this um, in front of tower here right now just to save a couple hogs if necessary and I still have the poison for the final three heroes. My warning will go down because he loves to be in the midst of everything. Um, I do have the poison that I could use but my RC is working on the skeletons basically. And why? What is this Rizzo doing? I I don't even wanna worry about that anymore. I don't know what my ward, what my what our wizard is doing. Why is he in the wall? The wizards need a a big overhaul. I don't know what the wizards are doing. I literally do not know what that wizard is doing. Why was he hitting the wall in the first place? I'm gonna pop my girl, my queen's ability, and I'm gonna pop my RC's ability, and she will get through some defenses. Hopefully they can get them here in time. They got, what, 12 seconds left? I think we're going to time fail. Yeah, we're going to time fail. Nice. We're going to time fail. We're going to get 99%. That hurts. That hurts. Everything went so well. Yeah, 98%. That sucks. That sucks, especially having a whole everything went. Everything went nicely together. Maybe I needed more cleanup. Okay. It still ended up working out. Five bullets probably was too much, but... I decided to run the hogs this time, I might run like a, uh, something smaller, but hey, we got 98% to start, it sucks, but it was still a decent try on that base, it should have been a triple, like they all should be, but hey, we're gonna have to end it off there, but as if you guys, if you guys enjoy it, not the result we wanted, but that happens, see you guys next time.